All right, everyone. It is me, Johnson Chen, and uh, hopefully uh, you had a good weekend. Make sure everything is running properly here. And yeah, you can you can hear me. I don't know why the thing looks. Hmm. Yeah, I've noticed the frame rate on my camera seems a little off. I wonder if it's because of either well, so the dungeon. Oh, maybe it's because of my game actually that's running in the background. Uh, yeah, well, luckily I'm not supposed to move around too much anyway. Alright, so anyway, uh, yeah, I guess, uh, so I released the new crypto, um, and we, and I also decided yesterday, along with Mitch, not to do the swap. Uh, it was always something, uh, that he always had some kind of issue with, and of course, uh, actually, I don't actually think people are unsubscribing because usually you just don't bother. So I think what's happening is people are getting deleted off the uh, YouTubes because now censorship's ramping up like crazy. Oh wow, that's a good looking logo in it. Yeah, so I did a lot. I um, that is a really nice sci-fi picture actually. Wow. Uh, so anyway, yeah, I did a lot of the trademark stuff for my game, got the artwork, it's like, it's finally done. So now all that's left is, I think I'm going to go back and rehone my skills and just try to add, like, you know, uh, re replace the turrets with, like, actual, like, you know, turrets instead of the default shit. Um, my fir the first time I tried doing it on my first project, you know, didn't go so well because, like, the, I followed the tutorials online, it just wouldn't work, right? But I was trying to do it with 2D sprites. Now that I'm going working with native 3D, which is what Unity was made for, I think hopefully I won't run into any problems. You know, plus it'll ease me back into programming before I start doing the final hardcore shit, which is, you know, the save function. Because uh, I saw an idle game. Because I've been bored so much, I was looking at an idle game, and one of the biggest complaints on one bad idle game was not everyone was complaining about the save function not working. So I want to make sure I don't have that problem. All right, so uh, oh, I should actually have that window open. Uh, one hundred coin. Um, uh, it's constantly doing this. I hate. I hate when it does this. All right, so we'll get to it when we uh, actually get to the uh, end of the thing. Uh, fortunately, I can't change the size of this graphic, so it's uh, it's kind of like too big. But I had to pay the guy, my guy, twenty five bucks for the logos for it. Did a, did a pretty good job. Yeah, so we'll get to that. Um, let's see. Yeah. So anyway, I didn't do any research. I'm still like trying to get this coin working. Kind of botched things by listing on uh, Bit BTC Pop first because I thought I could just you know sell some coins there and then raise the money for Crex. Well, I was really fucking mistaken, so now I had to do an ROI deposit into my fiat crypto account to try to come up with the rest, because Crack said they're going to change the price. They're not sure if they're going to raise it or lower it, so it's... Uh, so yeah, just been a little stressed from that, stressed from filing the trademark stuff. Everything went fine, for the most part, trademark. Well, I mean, I just filed the paperwork. I won't even hear a response for a while. I had, and that set me back, like, what, and the copyright stuff. That set me back five, six hundred dollars, all right? So my credit card bill is going to be, like, insane. <laughs> uh, uh, it's going to be insane. So I do have quite a bit riding on, um, I don't know why this is not working on uh, 100 coin coming, uh, you know, doing its thing. Uh, but we'll have to see, we'll have to see. All right, so anyway, uh, Bitcoin searches for this week have not been released. So hopefully it's gonna still be kind of good, right? But, you know, we'll see. Uh, 24 volume. Yeah, they, they kind of changed their site a little here. Oh, oops, that screwed up that guy's uh, ad. So Bitcoin dollars has dropped to 60.5%, so that's very good. 24 volume is 101 million market cap. Uh, Bitcoin's still pretty steady at 11,125. I thought it was going to go up, but it looks like it either wants to go back down or it doesn't feel like going up. So, all right. Uh, and everyone else is basically doing the same thing. Litecoin's at 57 bucks. A good old doggy coin's at 428.5 million market cap. So everything's more or less stable. Right, but I guess there's not much incentive to go up just yet, especially since uh, uh, Trump is kind of battling back, kind of, right? Um, 
He was at 17 percent. Now he's at 19 percent. So he is get. He's getting. He's getting there. Uh, the problem is Trump's just got like so much crap on his plate. That I mean I don't know. Like and they they've got the mail in voter fraud crap going on too. Well, I mean, it's, it's going to be rough. It's going to be rough. All right. So markets were up yesterday, I believe. And then today, right now, it's kind of like neutral. Uh, they drift lower or they're mixed amid. And then there's still still mail stocks going on. So they're trying to figure out how to scam us out of all our tax money. Google's $2.1 billion Fitbit deal hits Roblox as EU opens probe. Yeah, so Google's going on a rampage. Xbox Game Pass Ultimate gets Project X Cloud Game. Okay, actually, I really should click that because I'm curious about video games, obviously. But I'm not really that interested for the purpose of reading this. So that this already tells me. Uh, oh wow, he's stepping down. So this already tells me that things are either not going. Things there's no news, or the elites are starting to like you know scale back because I guess they're preparing for something evil, of course. Clorox CEO, coronavirus pandemic has forever changed the world. Yeah, and it was all man-made too. Trump and Democrats officials set to resume their bailout talks, so that's good. I just want my twelve hundred dollars, even though it's not going to be much, but I'll take it. Like that helped. That actually helps me with a lot with the Crex, you know, coming up with the Crex money. You know, at the very least, it'll pay for um, you know all the game development I've been doing so far. Uh, what are music swings to why the expected loss of revenue beats the evidence? Uh, it rose at 2.3. Uh, oh, okay, so they lost money, but it didn't lose as much money as investors thought, so that's why they're raising the stock price. Okay, so that's basically what this, uh, this means. I'm not going to read that. But yeah, that makes sense. Everyone doesn't have any more money, so... That's the thing. I mean, the globalists know that pushing this bullshit is make is harming them. I've said this before earlier this year, right? This harms the globalists. It, it harms everybody, but it harms the globalists some more. And this is a, a very good example of it. Now, the problem is, you know, they may not care because they have the financial reserves, like I do, to, to outlast this stuff. Everybody else, maybe not so much. Like, there was... There was a story, I think it was yesterday morning when I woke up Sunday morning, where, like, some guy, like, didn't want to wear a mask, so the store clerk said you had to wear a mask, then he got really angry and just pulled out his AK-47 and shot at everybody, including the cops, and somehow nobody died miraculously, so I think he was just deliberately not trying to kill anyone, I guess. Uh, anyway, so, yeah, uh, and of course, you got your left wing race baiters just attacking white people it's just disgusting and evil like these these like all these agitators are just like just evil people it's also the reason why i just don't want to retweet anybody that just wants to complain uh i want something done all right you know so i only want to retweet stuff where hey we did this so that's a that's a tweet uh uh that's a tweet about giving action well that reminds me i probably have to log into actually i'm curious can i actually um yeah because i'm logged in so yeah there we go uh let me see i want to actually hide this for a second firefox yeah there we go uh add an existing oh okay so it's only on my chrome account okay so yeah all right so never mind all right, we'll do that. All right, so because I actually added my the name of my game studio and then a hundred coin Twitter onto this account, but it doesn't actually show up here. So, but I'm not going to add it on this. So, uh, but that reminds me, I do have to actually. I'm going to actually open up a new window in my Chrome just to remind myself later. Uh, okay. Uh, let's see. And then, all right, so now I will remember. Um. Let's see, happy Twitter, wait, oh yeah, so anyway, I forgot where I was going with this, but basically, yeah, I mean, everyone's getting hurt, I, uh, the globalists take more damage, technically, however, they can outlast us, you know, because, you know, most people can't pay their bills, I mean, before, I mean, as it was typical before, you know, most Ameri a lot of Americans just are just literally one paycheck away from bankruptcy and getting kicked out, 
So, you know, I mean, who has who has more financial reserves? You know, rich people can last forever. You know, uh, us us non-rich people cannot. You know, and I'm somewhere like kind of like in the, I guess, upper middle class maybe. So yeah, nothing new at Eben. Uh, JMC coins at six to seven. Now I have actually been selling quite a bit of JMC coins. So I've been trying to come up with Crex money. Um, but it's actually going to be seven to eight, right? Once, uh, once I guess everyone wakes up and stuff. So, yeah. So there's that. Uh, four oh four is doing okay. Now it's at ninety nine to one seventeen, maybe up to one thirty. But to be honest, there's something really wrong with the proof of stake coins, with the exception of JMC coin. Like, there, everyone's just just dumping coins. <clears throat> what what makes what's insane is the market cap is, with the exception of four oh four coins market cap, it's like it's actually still pretty respectable. Like coin gecko, so I'm like just kind of confused. Uh, but I, all I know is market sentiment is just not happy. Uh, with that being said, two by two is at twenty nine thirty two. Uh, you know, it couldn't uh, it could not have picked a shittier time to go drop in half or even more than half, right? Which is why I created one hundred coin because we need something stable. Like it'll still go down when Bitcoin goes up, but at least it'll. Uh, the price swing should be not as bad because bit being after after all this time and it gives a thousand coins it's still worth like two to four satoshis of a bitcoin uh, two by two uh, Rix is at 73 to 80 so this just continues to decline I'd imagine you know this is just I mean Mitch hasn't said anything yet and uh, oh I forgot to mention you know he's working on you know he's he's testing he's He's already got the new wallet out. He just needs to test to make sure it's not broken. Uh, we're just going to change JMC coin to 200% APR because we are not going to do the swap. I'll make sure I put in the title that we're not swapping, but we're just increasing the APR to 200%. So um, at worst, I think it maybe it'll only drop to one to two. But on the other hand, it's already been it's extremely pretty stable. So we'll ha we'll have to see what it is, but. Uh, yeah, um, and then we're not going to do any swaps anywhere else because it's just going to cause too much reputation damage. Uh, and on top of that, it's like, yeah, I mean, it's kind of a shitty thing to have to do. So it's like, you know what, I'd rather just let the price drop. So, I don't know, like, I'm just going to have to tell people, yeah, the price drops or we do a swap, so just pick one. Like, I'm just going to be like, yeah, I'd rather just not do a swap. You know, it's just like, it's just going to do, just let the price drop, right? And, you know, that means we're just going to have to add more so uh, where's yeah here we go we're just gonna have to add more sub satoshis that like that's it i mean the problem is it's traded against bitcoin which is worth like 11 trillion dollars so you know it, it's just how it goes it's not the it's nothing anything wrong fundamentally with these coins per se it's just that bitcoin's just too much right i mean i'd rather have these coins traded against dog coin because that's a cheap coin all right. Anyway, so there's that. Uh, some poor guy got deleted off of YouTube because um, I've been getting the views and likes, not a whole lot, but you know it's it's all legit. And I've stopped using Parler, so you know. Uh, yeah, because I because I because I don't know what happened, but now I don't get anything. I don't think it's censorship, and uh, the hashtags seem to work just fine. So. Bitcoin will get stronger after crisis, says U.S. Congressman Emmer. Okay, the only reason why I want to read this is because it's a U.S. Congressman. Uh, after I parse the articles, then we'll go into uh, 100 coin. I mean, it's not much to say. It's just, you know, but there doesn't seem to be anything newsworthy for now. Big, well, in terms of Bitcoin, anyway. Bitcoin suppresses 12K, the tumbles, and you know, a high probability Bitcoin rise. USD sinks to 2008 levels. Well, yeah, because we are printing money like crazy and we're getting ready to do in our stimulus as we already saw over here that they're gonna do another round of bailouts Twitter hacker was previously caught stealing a fortune in Bitcoin yeah I cannot believe this guy is retarded like you're not it's like you, you didn't think you you weren't you're gonna stay anonymous right usually that will happen but you don't piss off Twitter like the actual Twitter crazy uh, first, we were as Fed years inflation rate of uh, C550K Bitcoin in play. I already called 500,000. Uh, retail investors, go read this investor. Yeah, so everything's just about the stupid. Uh, this guy definitely looks like an angry pedo there, man. God. You know, this asshole instead of being a hack, it could have just worked for me and just helped me with the game. We would have made good sustainable income. 
This is kind of the reason why I just get pissed off at fucking, you know, stupid people like this. You know, you, you, you're smart enough to actually hack Twitter. So why don't you create fucking computer programs that actually, you know, create value for people? You would make so much money. And because you were smart enough to be able to hack Twitter, you probably are a way better programmer than me. It, it just it just boggles my mind. Bitcoin market cap is not bigger than Intel or Coca-Cola. Really? Wow, that's actually pretty insane, but I will, I'll believe that. Twitter hackers were caught after saying Bitcoin. Okay, Bitcoin's right hanging after embrace risk. Well, they kind of don't have a choice because everything's kind of going to shit, so Bitcoin's pretty solid. Okay, uh, Ripple Kofar selling. Uh, okay, massive transfer. Okay, analyst Josh Rager updates. That's just that's a funny name. His last name is Rager. Russia declares cryptocurrency is legal but prohibits use for payments. Uh, okay, so that's an interesting, it's an interesting way to hedge things. All right, we'll read that. All right, I got well. Uh, this is hard. I don't know which one we want to read first. All right, look at that. Um, uh, people are not having a standing. Okay, hope for the schools. Uh, Sean Hannity is an old school boomer. An illegal late night coup. Nevada's clubhouse government made it impossible for to win the state. Post office could never handle the traffic that it used to go to steal the state. See you in court. Supporters are out in force today protesting Nevada. Democrats attempt to wrap their mass meal and fall it. Yeah, I remember the asshole that I don't like, that's a parasite, a network F word, who still hates Chinese people, by the way. Uh, well, he has intelligently scaled back his rhetoric, so at least there's that. Uh, he said that once he organized one of these protests and then Ronna McDaniel um, hijacked it and stealing his credit, I think he's lying. That's bullshit. He maybe brought people together, like, you know, well, I mean, I see Rhino kind of organizing this. Let's see, where was this Nevada? Yeah, he didn't even mention Nevada. So I just think he just likes to insert himself into, like, high-profile things and make it look like, you know, he's a very vain person, and I just don't like grifters. I just hate that he's still technically friends with the leader of the Gory Barat running other true America firsters. So he's a really good at, like, being a fucking parasite. So, you know, I think I'm definitely going to create, like, there's definitely going to be an anti-neocon, anti-grifter uh, set of characters in my show. And I want to portray them, like, as evil fucking people, because that's what they are. Um, and, but I have to do it, you know, in a very believable manner. So, like, you know, that'll give me the maximum impact. And I'm definitely going to be using him as, like, one of the, um, one of the things. Uh, models. To, uh, after Alice says Bitcoin, okay. Uh, yeah, blah blah blah. Yeah, all the rage right now is this DeFi stuff. Ugh, I'm so irritated. There's always a new thing. Yeah. But oh well, you know, money's coming into crypto, so what can I say? All right, so first let's get this out of the way. So there's really not much to say, right? It's your standard proof of stake coin. Uh, surprisingly, there's just not a lot. Like I don't know, just not getting a lot here. But I mean, everyone kind of knows me too. So actually, let me check the uh, Discord. Uh, we now have six plus eleven, and then we had a couple scammers at the ball and kick them out. So yeah, we got eleven people in here, minus two because myself and then the pro bot. Uh, so. 17 minus 2 is 15. So it's still growing, which is pretty good considering that there's practically no marketing. Um, I'm actually trying to see if I can pump up my AIDS account with free income and then use that for the marketing budget. So it's like a self-sustaining loop. Um, uh, with that being said, there's nothing to market yet because we're not on Crex. But uh, let's see, did, my, did I get the notification for the wire transfer? uh my god how long does it take i mean the problem is i think they're they're operating west coast time so it's 7 6 a.m so i hope i'll hear something in an hour or two uh so anyway where was i oh yeah so basically it's your standard proof of stake coin but instead of a percent reward it's 100 flat coins so if we go to block explorer which took like a million years 
Yeah, like, we couldn't get it to work. I tried installing it, didn't work. Mitch tried installing it, didn't work. So I finally found a nice guy on Fiverr to just pay him 40 bucks, and then he, he got it done in, like, two, three hours. I was like, it's a miracle. So, yeah, and then now it works, so... And I have the experimental links for whatever, because for some, because I can't seem to really add anything down here. I don't want to risk screwing out the layout.js. So, yeah. But anyway, uh, so why did I bring that up? Oh yeah, duh. Let me go. Oh yeah, I have a crappy looking website, but that's because I just been so busy with everything else. Though, because all I have to do is just find a good looking WordPress site and then just make sure it works with the way I have it set up. Um. Let's see. Yeah, so you see the reward is just a flat 100. So basically, I real so I figured out that basically what happens is you trade your short term price for medium to long term stability, and that's what we want is stability. Uh, and because of the way this is a fork from Black Coin version 3.0, so I guess because of the way they operate, like the minimum difficulty is always 65,536, which sounds like a lot, but it's actually not too bad. Uh, but it definitely skyrockets like crazy pretty quick once it, this thing uh, starts minting like crazy. There's just not a lot of coins. Uh, but yeah, the target block time is actually one minute. Hmm. But sometimes it can go up to ten minutes. Excuse me. And the retarget is every two blocks or every two minutes. Uh, that mint stake age is only four hours, so you can start minting like a champ once you have enough of these coins. And the max stake stake age actually gains over time too, so it'll eventually stake all your coins. Uh, unlimited supply, of course, and the algorithm script. I say about like for the second coin, I'm gonna actually create like a master node coin too. Like those are more complicated, but I think that has the advantage of creating a very huge incentive for people to buy a coin. So they can set up their own master node. Because if you don't do that and you just stake like normal, what happens is the master node people take half or whatever specified. In my case, I'm just going to specify half. Right? They'll just automatically take half your rewards. Uh, so there's a big incentive to buy. Uh, and plus, people like master node coins better than traditional proof of stake. You know. So I tried telling Mitch that, but he just got kind of mad-ish. Well, not mad, but a little upset because he's like, well, you're pushing all these coins and it's devaluing the other projects, which technically is true, but there's not much more we can do. Also, I told him that, like, you know, like, when you, when the value of the coin drops 50, 60, 70 percent all the time, like, there's not, there's no support that we can do. It's just going to piss people off. So, you know, people need stability, all right? And we're not going to abandon the projects. I made that very clear, so, yeah. Anyway, after you mint, you gotta wait 30 transactions, and if you're sending money back and forth, you just gotta, you know, wait 10 transactions. So this is pretty quick. Here are your sources, here are the ports, it's all synced to explore, and then of course all the uh, websites here. Also, I actually have full control over all the social media this time, because I want to do it my way. <clears throat> um, so... Hmm. Uh, because um, he's not in it for the long haul. <clears throat> and uh, I actually wanted to contribute to the uh, social media for JMC and 4.4 coin, but Mitch has control of it. So, you know, it's like, okay, then I'll just do it myself. Yeah. So, uh, here's my, here all my shit. Uh, right now we're on BTC pop, but, you know, once the wire transfer comes through, hopefully I'll be able to. I should be able to pay with it. I don't know. I mean, they operate. Crex operates in UK time, I think, which is funny because they don't uh, allow UK people. So I don't know. I know that it must be somewhere in Europe, but it's gonna be like sleeping time for them. But yeah, I'll have it. I'll, I'll definitely be able to make the announcement that we're on. We're gonna be on Crex. So, um, and then yeah, and then here's your faucet. Now the problem is, I thought I was gonna be able to sell coin to BTC Pop, and then you know raise a lot of the raise a lot of the Crex money that way. Uh, just, just, uh, boy was I wrong. Boy was I wrong. Uh, I'm going to refresh one more time. But yeah, it definitely goes to show that, uh, I way overestimated, uh, the quality of Bit BTC Pop in terms of how much they charged me for what I was going to get in return. There's still a good exchange, but it's just not nearly as good as I thought. So... Yeah, so if I, basically if I didn't do this, 
I would have had to put in like a lot. In fact, I probably would not have had to do a wire uh, wire deposit. So, uh, but yeah, so it's like you know that's just that's just how it goes. You know, I, I you know I, I'll have to make some mistakes, and eventually I was gonna put on BTC pop anyway. But because I have to reverse everything, you know, now it causes a little bit of you know you know a little bit of damage. So you know, uh, not too bad. But it can feel, but it feels bad because my myopic loss aversion is like starting to kick in. Yeah, that's why I've been so stressed. You know, cause between you know doing uh, just simply spending money in the game, working on the game, and then of course doing this, it's just like uh. But uh, that's just how it goes. You know, you have to keep working and fighting. Uh, so you know. Uh, here are the logos, and then blah 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 blah. Uh, yeah, so that's pretty much it. There's not much, but uh, yeah, it should it should definitely be pretty stable. Uh, well, we'll have to see. Maybe it'll just be a disaster and cracks, and then I'm gonna start really freaking out. But I don't think so. BTC pop people definitely want the coin, but they're just like undercutting like crazy because there's so little traffic. So all right, you know, and there's just like screw off. We're we're gonna take it to cracks, which is what I should have been because that's what I used to do in the beginning. So yeah. I mean, maybe I am getting old. Russia declares cryptocurrency is legal but prohibits use of payments report. Oh yeah, so basically, the, yeah, the coins lie. You can get it from BTC pop ish, right? Um, uh, but I mean, or you probably just wait for cracks, really. Russia declares crypto is legal but prohibits use of payments. Okay, so it's declared it crypto legal after Putin signed a bill recognizing that crypto as a type of property, but you can't use it for payments. Uh, which is hilarious because what if you just say, okay, I'm trading one property for another, all right? You know, it's not illegal, I'm sure, even in Russia to trade your, like, your boat for, like, a house or something, right? You're trading stuff for stuff. Quote of Russian records, build number blah, blah, blah. Uh, the lower house of, uh, okay, the bill made its way to Putin last month, okay. To approve a federal law, a digital federal law, a digital career that administers certain legislative action of the Russian Federation. This resolution comes into force from the date of its acceptance. According to Russia News RIA, nor heard of legislators define crypto as a means of savings and investment, but not as a means of payment. In addition, the and NA should report their crypto holdings for tax purposes. Bill also says Russian banks and crypto exchange will have the capacity to legally sell, purchase, and facilitate the exchange of crypto after registering with the central Russian bank. Uh, Anatoly Aks Aksakov, head of Duma, uh, says, kind of related to the bill of crypto, such as WMI, will be addressed in a separate bill, which may be passed before the end of the year. Okay. All right, so Russia basically has made crypto legal, and they just say, yeah, just don't use it for payments, which is kind of worthless, because, yeah, because people will just simply hide it. Oh, yeah, it's for investment purposes. <laughs> yeah, but, I mean, I guess, I guess they could... Kind of figure out that it's bullshit. Like, let's say you trade it for stuff, and then you have to report on your taxes. Uh, but I mean, I guess people would just lie, right? They'll just say, "Oh, I invested, and then I lost all the money." Uh, that's very common. People trade in crypto and lose their money. Like, what's the Russian government going to say, right? Um, yeah. So basically, people will just start lying. So it's actually not that bad. But this is a very good. This is very good because like Russia has just been so hostile towards crypto for the most part and then you know they finally got their heads out of their asses so especially since like you know they figured especially since they must have figured hey you know america's not really doing much with crypto but we can right and they're also close with china and china's very pro cryptocurrency believe it or not they the only time they get mad is when they lose control of the situation so as long as they have control then they then they love crypto right and they're, they're coming out with china coin too so yeah so I'm sure Putin's like you know figured it out. Also, I found out he's actually my my height five eight. Yeah, you know, I'm actually a little like a little taller maybe, but it's essentially the same. So it's like wow, I always thought Putin was like a tall guy. Bitcoin will get stronger at the crisis, says U.S. Congressman Emmer. So the only reason why I care about this is because it's a U.S. Congressman. Uh, the bright future of Bitcoin and blockchain tech. Largest crypto Bitcoin is not going away. He is a Republican from Minnesota. An industry known advocate, a known industry advocate, Emmer says Bitcoin will only get stronger after a world emerges. My 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 head scratchy. That's why I do this. Uh, from the economic chaos caused by the coronavirus, Bitcoin blockchain will continue to become more important. Yeah, because you're not gonna have a choice. 
Well, at least I'm told the American government's, you know, starts banning crypto too. Let's come out of the crisis. Bitcoin going away. It's going to get stronger. Uh, he was doing an interview with Anthony Pompolio. According to Emmer, both Bitcoin's underlying tech, a blockchain, will continue to become more popular and important. You just watch it as valid, well, something as valid, people are going to take risks and it's going to advance. Yeah, because they don't have a choice. Especially if people believe that uh, the system is rigged even more against them than now. So yeah, they'll do crypto. So this is very good. Uh, crypto is going to skyrocket. Uh, this is going to be perfect for all of us. The problem is when it crashes, these same assholes are going to be like, we need to regulate and ban crypto. And that's just going to hurt us so much. So it's, uh, it's going to be a double-edged sword, but... That's always been the history of all um, commodities, right? You know, since since man figured out how to do trading on like a public exchange like several hundred years ago or whatever. Actually, I'm thinking about the tulip bulb mania of like 1619. Tulip bulb mania when? When, when was it? Oh, 1936. So it was off by uh, 17 years. Or maybe that's when it began. The officer, and then it ended in 36, uh, 1636. I see officer in the office of the currency officially approved federal chart bags to store. Blah, 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 blah. Whatever. Um, okay. And now we're going to say, hey, so you can start banking this stuff. You can provide a home for it. You can start working with it. Uh, I don't know. So you are going to smile. You're very friendly. God is calling. to provide more regulatory clarity. I was not alone thinking that. Blah, 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 blah. Tim Draper. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. All right, so it's just basically a puff piece, but that's a good puff piece. Um, and again, it's important because he's a U.S. congressman. That's what matters. In this case, I mean, I don't like status and reputation bullshit, but fortunately, it's a part of you know just the human psyche. Um, and the point is, a U.S. congressman is you know a very powerful person, right? Not the most powerful, but still very powerful nonetheless, right? You know, uh, so you know he holds specifically one. By 100 and one out of 535 uh, fraction of, of, of power in, in, in like our legislature, so to make laws, very important. Okay, stop autoplay. I hate, I hate, I hate, I hate autoplays. You're, they're so annoying. All right, so I think we kind of covered it. You know, overall, not a lot of news happening, but so far, crypto wise, everything's solid. You know, domestically. Financially, I mean, you know, it could be a different story for everyone else. But, you know, we've been through this kind of crap before and we'll endure as always. And again, <clears throat> once I get <clears throat> 100, <clears throat> once I get 100 coin on cracks, we should be uh, quite solid. Uh, we'll have to see. And then once that happens, then I can start doing coin gecko, coin checkup, start submitting start submitting stuff um and then uh yeah and then i have to start thinking about marketing too uh, i'll probably just do a ads marketing just do a limited run all right because once people find out with the coin then that's it and then uh yeah we'll see we'll see <clears throat> um what you would call it yeah so anyway uh, if you like what you saw or rather heard hit the like button the follow button or subscribe button from wherever you're watching this from or my YouTube's at youtube.com forward slash JMC Radio. Make sure you smash that subscribe on the right hand side of this page so we can continue growing this channel, especially now that, you know, I guess people are slowly getting deleted off of YouTube. All right, so anyway, uh, obviously I'm done for the day. Uh, I think I don't have much to do, to be honest. Uh, I just kind of just need a rest and recover from stress. Uh, and then just start, and then once I recover, then, you know, start, uh, going back to working on the game, you know, um, you know, I make sure my computer programming, uh, skills don't atrophy. And then of course, in the meantime, I'll slow, well, not slowly, but I'll, uh, keep working on a hundred coin, right? You know, but of course the big thing is get it on corrects. And I definitely learned my lesson. Um, if, I, if you know, I, if like if I have to go quantity, I really need to make sure I go quantity. Otherwise, I should just stick with quality, right? And 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 then build up quality, uh, quantity from there. Uh, so I made a uh, just made a mis so I made a mistake that way. Yeah, but it's, uh, it's frustrating. But you know, once we get on correct, so I'll get my money back or at least a large portion of it. Uh, and then we'll go from there. Right? And of course, we'll uh, JMC coin will be back to two hundred percent. And because it's not a swap, so even if you miss it, it's not a big deal. You just lose time, but you still have all your 
stuff until uh, I think we set it to three weeks time period. So three weeks worth of blocks. So it's so like an additional twenty thousand or twenty five thousand blocks or something. So uh, yeah, yeah, we'll we'll, we'll we'll be set. Anyway, see you all uh, tomorrow's video. Um, let's see. I guess we'll fix this. Oh, actually, uh, yeah, we're talking about this coin actually. So yeah. My God, this is the kind of reason why I wish I could. I was allowed to readjust the size. This thing is too big. But what are you gonna do? All right. Anyway, see you all tomorrow. Thanks, Judson Chan, JMC Coin, 404 Coin, and here's our little thumbnail.